Even if you don't think you've invested in tech stocks, you likely probably have if you have a retirement fund. Nick Martell and Jack Kramer co-founded the financial newsletter Market Snacks. They join us now to discuss the impact of investing in highly valued tech stocks. Mm. So thank you for joining us. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. What should investors be looking for when you're investing in tech stocks like Google and Facebook? Yeah, I think we need to kind of identify the six elephants in the room. There are six gigantic American tech companies that have incredible stock growth in the past couple of and years. And they're typically called FANG. That doesn't really do it justice. It's really the phantom of stock. So it, tech is really tied into so much. If yeah. you're investing, I mean, it's almost, you just can't avoid it at this point. Oh, absolutely. It's everywhere. The key, though, is really the profit side, right? Right. As an investor, you yeah. want to take a part in the profit growth that's happening in the American economy. Mm -hmm. And it's happening in these six tech companies. So we took a look at the most recent quarter, mm -hmm. first quarter of 2018. These six companies only make up about 1% of the S&P 500, but they actually make up 13% of the profits in the wow. S&P 500. And that goes exactly to what we were quarter. talking about, how technology is every company. You can't really take the tech sector and separate it because every company is involved, even traditional industries. You think about cars, for instance, you know, your Fords, your GMs, those are tech companies now in the way that they're investing in autonomous vehicles. So in the long run, are tech stocks really worth the investment? I think so. We need to think about what are the industries of the future because as a retirement investor, you want to take part in the profits of the future. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about autonomous vehicles, yeah. um, 5G wireless technology, Internet of Things. Who's going to lead in these spaces? It's the six tech companies that we just talked about, the and Fanama companies. When it comes to the risks involved, we're talking about regulation as a key risk right now. That's very, very top of mind. Regulation is the kind of risk that's very short term. You know, and it may affect these stocks immediately as they have to adjust to regulation. Long term, the purpose of regulation is to provide stability, and that's what that does with the tech industry. Nick Martell, Jack Kramer, thank you very much for joining us. Thanks, Rena.